Spring is amazing! Even the blackboard is blooming! Too bad we have class on our schedule instead of spring! Cindy, go back to your desk! Fresh grass and flowers! But how do you write on it now? Chalk doesn't work on grass! Miss Olivia, I've got an idea! Make words on the grass board out of bright flowers. Cut different flowers from square pieces of colored foam paper. Draw veins on the petals with markers. Put a pin with a bead into the center and crumple the foam paper to shape it like a flower. Make a lot of colorful flowers. Miss Olivia is planting the flowers on the board like a real gardener. That's beautiful! The flowers make up a very beautiful word Get ready for a flowery test, guys! <laughs> Miss Olivia is checking our tests! Oh no! The whole group failed! Guys, what were you thinking? You should be ashamed of yourselves! But Tommy knows how to calm the teacher down! Our giant marker will help her relieve some stress! Attach a painted Crayola label to an empty Pringles carton. Cut the rim off a plastic cup. Cut out a round hole in the bottom. Coat the inside of the cup with white acrylic paint. And put in a foam rubber roll. Attach the cup to the bottom of the carton. Make it look like the tip of a marker. Take three different kinds of stuffing for three balloons. Pull balloons onto a funnel. And put in styrofoam balls, slime, and flour. Put the squishy balls into the carton. Dissolve red gouache in some water. Soak the roll in it using a pipette. Cut another chip container and wrap it in colored paper. Put it on the marker to be a cap. Miss Olivia, here you go! This marker will help you cope with the stress from our low grades. Oh, this is a huge marker, full of stress balls. Miss Olivia loves squishies. She's in a better mood right away. A happy teacher wouldn't give low grades. We did a good job. That's it! A giant F for everyone! Whoops! Cindy, I'm so sorry! I didn't mean to! You didn't mean to? Kelly, you ruined my notes! I'll ruin yours! Their rage is destroying them! But at that moment, the fairy of friendship and kindness flies to the rescue! Take this magical crystal! It will help you correct your mistakes! Cut a crystal from a piece of memory foam. Make a hollow inside and glue in a roll of whiteout tape. Coat the crystal with pearly blue paint. Apply different purple shades of rubber paint on top. Accent the edges. Apply drips of hot glue to the base. Coat it with gold acrylic paint. The girls can fix all their mistakes. Oh, Miss Olivia is back to being a regular teacher! Girls, keep writing! Kelly loves eating in class, but she's already out of supplies! And now she's getting sad! Poor Kelly! She's dreaming about food! But her friends have something better! A mini fridge for a real gourmand! Trim an edge of a rectangular plastic box with a heated utility knife. Coat the inside of the box and the lid with a few layers of white acrylic paint. Attach four sticky half beads to the sides to be legs. Make two hinges from white foam paper and attach them to the fridge door. Break a clip off a marker cap. Glue it to the door as a handle. Cut shelves from a clear plastic paper folder. Glue plastic and cardboard shelves into the fridge. Glue little magnets to the top corner of the door and the fridge. Fill the mini fridge with small school supplies. Here, Kelly, have fun! Wow, this is the best gift ever! A portable fridge with food inside! Or not! Who would chew on sticky notes or a stapler? Take your fridge back, Tommy! You are so mean! 
Come on, Kelly. Don't be mad. Mm. Here, take an apple. <sighs> Professors get stressed sometimes, too. How could they possibly make so many mistakes on a test? It was easy. The students must have been tired. Stay calm, colleague. You need to blow off some steam. How about a game of table pool? Mark pockets on cardboard in a pencil case. Cut them out and wrap the cardboard in green felt. Glue the game field into the pencil case. Make a triangle from a strip of cardboard. Place the triangle on the field. Put little beads into it like mini pool balls. Even out the balls with the triangle. And put another bead in front. Coat the lid of the case with a few layers of acrylic paint. Attach a printed picture of balls that say billiard. Put pencils and an eraser into the other half of the case. Take a pencil instead of a pool cue and start playing mini pool in a pencil case. Miss Olivia hit the ball into the pocket. No, she missed. Wow, the real pool fans are here. The final hit. The blue-eyed professor wins. What are the professors doing here? Is this a pool club? Whoops, I think I was hallucinating. Everyone keeps copying answers from Cindy. This time, everyone did great and Cindy got the lowest grade. That's not fair. Next time, Cindy will get ready for the test with a special anti-coping defense system. A fan notebook. Coat the spine of a hardcover notebook with two layers of white acrylic paint. Hot glue pattern paper to the cover. Make it half an inch longer on one side. Attach cardboard to both sides. Fold colored paper into a fan and glue it to the cardboard on the cover. Now no one can copy from my notebook. Cindy is calm. The fan is hiding the correct answers. Be careful! Stop breathing! I'll take it out right now! Phew! Tommy and Kelly are playing a very stressful game. Hi, guys! Cindy, what have you done? Our tower! You'll pay for this! Whoops! Guys, I'm so sorry! Cindy has nowhere to run anymore. She can only hide behind her unusual bag. Put styrofoam beanbag filling into a clear, thick plastic bag. Add colorful styrofoam art sticks. Wrap the edge of the bag in parchment paper and seal it with an iron. Make two pieces like that and seal them to each other on three sides. Fold up the edges. Cut two rings from thick cardboard. Wrap the rings in faux fur. and attach them to the bag as handles. Whoa, look at this purse, it worked! The other students got distracted by the unusual bag and Cindy can run away. This rustling toy can calm anyone down. That sound, just listen to it and touch it. This is so much fun. A college hallway is a very dangerous place. You never know when a ball might hit you. Miss Olivia missed the pass and dropped her glasses. Poor thing! But the girls decided to do something nice for their favorite professor. They have a special case for her glasses. Take identical square pieces of faux fur, bubble wrap, and soft pink fabric. Trace a template of a heart case on them and cut out three pieces. Sew a heart-shaped button to the fur piece and a loop for fastening the case. Sew all layers together. Fur, then fabric, and bubble wrap. Sew the edge of the case as a pocket. Close the heart-shaped top with a loop. Miss Olivia, here are your glasses. And here's a case for them. This is a soft heart that's full of stress-relieving material. Oh, thanks. It's so cute. I could use a stress reliever at this college. 
Did you like our relaxing school supplies? Then comment below what you'd copy. A giant marker, a pool table in a pencil case, or a crystal with white out inside. And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so that you don't miss new stress-relieving school supply ideas from Troom Troom.